Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to bring you this video. This is the long awaited adult Halloween lunches. So I've been posting many kid Halloween lunches and what you can do for your kiddos lunchbox, but we always need something for those adult lunchboxes just to spruce things up a little bit, make it a little bit more fun and make work a little bit more bearable if y'all know what I'm talking about. So I wanted to come up with some Halloween lunches and ideas for y'all. You definitely have all of this week and a little bit of next week to get some inspiration for those adult lunches, whether it be your teenager, your hubby or yourself. Let's get into seeing how we can spruce things up for those adult Adult lunches. Alright y'all, so this lunch I was loving. This is turkey burgers and these are the Genio, like the seasoned ones. They are so good. These eye picks I got off Amazon. I will have them linked below and that's just a cookie cutter I use for the bread. I'm serving it with a little packet of mayonnaise, some pickles for my burger and I also have over here a Baby Bell cheese that I use those edible food writers with that I've been showing in the kiddo lunches to make it look like an eyeball. And I'm just using some cupcake liners here instead of my usual silicone ones. Ones. Then I have my picks that I've been buying off of Amazon and I just made little fruit kebabs with the picks. Just such an easy way to have like something to hold your fruit with and to make it look super cute too. So I was loving that. And then I made my own little inspirational bag that says, uh, Monday, you got this with a little ghost face on it with some ranch veggie straws. I mean, I was loving this lunch and all my coworkers were like, stop it, Nicole. Okay, for Tuesday, we're making adult Lunchables and I'm using these little tiny cookie cutters that look like Batmans um, to make the cheese and I have some pepperonis down there. Then I made these pumpkin carrots. Now this doesn't look as easy as it might seem. Um, that was a, a trial and error, okay? <laughs> then I'm serving it with some hummus. Again, I've got the little cute spider picks here just to spruce it up. And then I made deviled eggs over the weekend to have incorporated my lunches all week. And I'm serving it with these cupcake liners. Again, such a cheap way instead of using the silicone kind to make it super cute. The Slight and Fit Original Greek Yogurt, the Caramel Apple Pie was bomb. Y'all definitely need to try it. I need to buy some more of that. It's so good. And then I'm serving my Lunchable with these townhouse crackers. And these are new that I purchased and these are the flatbread Italian herbs and they are really good just like the pita chips that I really like by that brand as well. All right, to Wednesday, we're having mummy kebabs, and I did buy those edible eyes off Amazon. They will be linked below, and I just took some bread and made like little squares to make a little kebab here, and it looks like a mummy, and I used my toothpicks from Amazon as well. I got more of these pumpkin carrots, and I'm serving it with some hummus in my little Dollar Tree container over here. Carrots and hummus is bomb. I never had it before. I always eat hummus, but I never try it with carrots, and it's so good. And then I've just got my little fruit kebab skewers again here with my strawberry berries and blueberries and then I'm serving it with my favorite ranch veggie straws on the side. Simple lunch but really tasty. All right, y'all, so Thursday, my favorite meal for adult lunches. I've had this before on my videos to show y'all from my last adult lunch video, but it's just nachos and these are the blue corn tortilla chips from Walmart, the organic kind. And there's my Frankenstein I made with my guacamole cup. I am no artist by any means, but I thought it came out darn cute. Don't judge here, but I enjoyed it. Didn't take any time at all, no fuss, just to make that super cute. And you can do that with your kids too. And then I've got my sour cream in my little Dollar Tree container here. And then I've also got my freshly shredded cheddar cheese that I'm going to be putting on top and just put in the microwave for about 20 seconds and you're good to go. I've got my deviled eggs with my spider pick again. These deviled eggs I've made on foodie before, I think, and if I have, I'll link them in the cards above. And I'm also going to be eating the salted caramel Nusa yogurt. This stuff is amazing. If you've never tried it, y'all have got to buy this. It tastes like dessert. It is so yummy. So that was Thursday's lunch, guys. One of my favorite adult lunches. Okay, so Friday's lunch is a morbid, gross-looking finger that I made from a hot dog. This is an easy way to make your hot dogs look nasty for Halloween but taste yummy. And then I'm serving it with some more deviled eggs that I had left over and then a cheese stick that I made look like a ghost. As you can see, it's Paw Patrol. This is so easy for teenagers, yourself, and kiddos to make little ghost cheese sticks. How adorable. And that hot dog was so bomb. 
All right, y'all, so that is all the lunches I have to bring you for adult lunch inspiration for Halloween. I hope this video was inspirational and gave you some ideas to amp up your teenager, your hubby, or yourself's lunches to get you through the festive Halloween season for the next week and a half. I really enjoyed these guys. They really put a smile on my face and made me look forward to lunch, which I always look forward to lunch, but made me look forward to going to work and for lunch, which is a big deal. And everybody that saw these lunches, my coworkers always has something to say about them. And that's always a nice conversation starter when it comes to lunch as well. And I really enjoyed some of these pairings that I haven't made for myself before. Like I've never bought the Baby Bell cheese for myself for lunches. And the hummus and the carrots was a nice addition instead of just using the pita cracker. So I was really enjoying that. So I'll give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy adult lunchbox inspiration and you want to see more lunchbox inspiration for adults make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not with me already i'd love to have you a part of the youtube family here and until next time with another lunchbox video i've got so many ideas for fall and then christmas of course so y'all don't want to miss it so stay tuned and i'll see you guys in my next video have a great one bye